All right, when you go get your entertainment news, who you rather be with? Who you rather get it from? Eliano, you understand? You'd rather get it from Deliano. This entertainment news is some chicks running around on TikTok right now saying that Beyonce is overrated. Lady Gaga is more iconic than that. You, you, excuse me? Scared me? Lady Gaga more iconic than her? What kind of dope y'all been smoking? That's the step on pack. Y'all need to get up off that joint, man. Go ahead and visit another block. You understand? Mystical, you out here being a super creep, Chester the Molester, Pike Street ass nigga, man. We can't deal with niggas like you. You understand me? He out here praying on the women and not praying like a hunt, but praying along with them before he sexually assaults them. This is out fucking rages, man. I don't understand this shit. That's a sickness. Oh, Veneers, you got everybody fucked up. The veneers, man, they giving y'all niggas horse mouth out here. Be careful. Where you getting your veneers done out at? Your veneers is starting to turn like horse mouth. So this is really stupid, but do not get veneers. Don't go to teeth by Keisha out of a country if you don't want to look like this. Do not get veneers. Y'all see how these buckaroos look? My motherfucking teeth look like they look like a whore fucking horse. The fuck? I'm not. I'm getting these taken out. Going back there. I got to fly all the way back there just to get these taken out. I don't like them at all. And I'm so dumb. I get up. The chair don't even say nothing. I'm just leaving like a dumb ass. I hate them. All right. This Deliano excited. I'm excited as usual. But how about the Meagles? How about them Eagles 3-0 and and I'm giving you RBG flavor today. You dig Marcus Garvey? How about them Eagles 3-0 and laid the smacketh down today on Washington? I don't like calling them the Commanders. That's the worst name ever. They going to lose as long as they name the Commanders. But they caught that 24-8 treatment today. First quarter, four sacks. Hell in hot water. Oh, yeah, the defense got busy today. They deserved the ball. They gave them niggas hell in hot water, but the second quarter is when it started getting crazy. You understand? It's when it started acting a nuisance, man. I'm talking about we crap a little, a little touchdown in there, but really, really, we got our fifth sack on the open up. You dig? Our second touchdown by A.J. Brown with 27 seconds on the clock of that quarter. Jalen launched that puck towards the motherfucking end zone, and what a major throw. And even a better catch. Ladies and gentlemen, they were getting crazy today. Devontae Smith was not giving these niggas no room. You had no room today, Commander. No room. Devontae Smith was acting crazy. He got on the elevator and caught that pup. And then right after that, on fourth and goal with 18 seconds left on the clock, he climbed back up the escalator to get another one. For seven more points. You understand me? Devontae Smith was acting a nuisance. Who knows how they got a safety? No clue that was so amateur in calling. That was just whack. I don't know. Maybe they felt sorry for him. Needed him to get on the board. But we got our eighth motherfucking sack. In the fourth quarter. Got our eighth sack with 8.56 on the clock by Josh Sweat. He was acting crazy too. He was another nigga acting crazy, man. Straight up, man. Fourth quarter, 155 on the clock. Them jive turkeys had a two-point conversion fail. They even got it picked off. By <laughs> hey, yo. What's going on out here with Floyd Mayweather robbing the bank as usual? My man. Boy, I admire that boy. He get that easy money, man. He don't work hard at all. But he just... Beat the shit out the ball from Japan. Makaru, <laughs> Makaru stood no chance. Uh, Asakura. <laughs> yeah, you know I mean, Makaru stood no chance. Asakura, straight out of Japan, man. And did you peep the weak ass stage push by the bodyguard? Boy, that was set up, man. You couldn't. Hey, hey, look, Floyd, you gotta take classes. You gotta get acting classes up in you and the and the people around you, man. Y'all improv skills is just, you know, just go ahead and box and keep making us proud with that. What else is happening, man? What else is going on? Jake Paul, he on Mayweather ass right now trying to win a fight. He just trying to get a fight from Floyd. He trolling. That's what y'all call it. Trolling. He trolling to get that money. You know, Floyd, the money fight. And that's all I got for you for entertainment news. So let's go ahead on over to being black. If you're going ahead over to being black in Buffalo, New York, 
Veterans Monument. The African Americans has a Veterans Monument over there in Buffalo, New York. It was dedicated to him Saturday in upstate New York. The monument celebrates the contributions of Black American veterans who served in all 12 of the country's major conflicts dating back to, to the Revolutionary War. Yes, sir. Let me read a little bit of it. Let me read a little bit. This is the dedication, the unveiling of not just Buffalo's first, not just New York's first, but our nation's first African-American veteran monument, she said. This is what the lady said. Who chow or who chow, however way you say her name. This monument will exemplify everything we look for in our black soldiers. They were our heroes. They were our leaders. Our black soldiers served in the spirit of excellence, making sure that Americans could enjoy the bad, the bad station of freedom. That's a word. I ain't never even you heard me. <laughs> Legislator Howard Johnson had kicked that one for you. So just know that it's going up and down and you just got that shit straight from cookies and cream, Philly block talk, Deliano, giving them my roses.